Lewisburg, West Virginia, home of the 1995 Greenbrier East High School Marching Band. They are the pride and spirit of Greenbrier County. The Greenbrier East High School Marching Band is proud in heritage. Those who have worn the green and gold say it's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. A lot of people go through this high school and they don't do anything the whole time they're here and they sort of get lost in the crowd. And I feel like in some way we're, we keep coming back in order to give that back to the kids that are in the band now. Hopefully they'll get the same thing out of it that we got out of it. Yeah, it's really, it's really um, nice to go to a competition and have all the other bands looking up to you and seeing parts, things that we do incorporated into their programs from watching us. Prepared you for life, didn't it? Yep. It was a good preparation. A lot of hard work, but it always paid off. Past success of the Pride in Spirit is quite apparent. Just look around the band room. For Jeff Bryant and company, they start early in the season. We spent a lot of time pre-planning. We actually even started next year's show. Uh -huh. um, we started at this really? month, just putting down all the ideas and kind of getting a lot of brainstorming. What do you do on the computer with the show? I mean, um, well, we uh, I know some people do their drill on the uh, computer. Um, we don't do that, but we do a lot of our music on here. Put a lot of our music, really? and uh, uh, that way can you know, it's notated out for the kids and. Uh, uh, also, um, just a lot of the general ideas of show concepts are here. Benton Hot East! Two leaders take attendance. Special leaders take attendance. For Greenbrier East, before practice, they muster, which allows them to clearly focus. Six and six. President and counter for sir. Seven. For President and counter for sir, except for Jesse Farron, Scott Applegate, and Derek Branch. Eight. Our president count for sir. Nine. Our president count for sir, except for Jonathan McGraw and B.J. Heath. The roll call tells about that. It's very serious. Mm -hmm. What do you all think it's so serious? I'm talking about. Um, it's a tradition. Okay, anybody know anything about Brian Smith? There's a lot, a lot of meaning into it. Ten. Our president count for sir. Section 11. Our president count for sir. 12. Our president count for sir. 13. Our president count for sir. It's about the roll call. Yeah. It sounds very official. Right? What to do to get everybody pumped up? Right John Applegate? Right? Yeah, it's just a quick way to take attendance. Benton <laughs> It's time to suit up, in which you'll see a proud tradition unfold right before your eyes. They love to hate finding their uniforms in which the best can have the worst happen. Is it there? Excuse me. <laughs> One of the joys of marching band is trying to find your uniform. What's that like, man? I mean, it's kind of unusual. You, know, you have to sit here and go through all these uniforms. It's a rush. Is it? Especially when you can't find it. Where is it? I have no idea. What if you grab the wrong one? You've got a problem, huh? Probably, because it wouldn't fit too good. Sometimes you can't find it, even though you're looking in your section. You just can't find it. Great to get ready to put those colors on, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's exciting. What's it like to be a part of this band? Um, it's kind of like being in a family almost, I think. You know what I'm saying? It's Absolutely. Like, we're like a family almost. What's so. it What's it like as you get ready to prepare for today's performance? What is that like? I don't know really. I've never actually had this really done before. Because I'm used to just like seeing the cameras on the sideline. I'm not like used to having them like right up close to the face and everything. You know what I'm saying? Those who have ever suited up in the green and gold say it's an incredible experience. 
I don't know. It's pretty fun. What's it like to wear the uh, the green and gold though? I mean, explain that. What's that feel like? I just like, I don't know. It's just like, you feel like, I don't know how you feel when you have it on. It's just, I don't know. You like it. Makes you, it makes you feel better about yourself, doesn't it, as a, as a performer out here? Yeah, pretty much. That's what put that, feel. put that baby on. It's nice. Right here. Tell us about the, the uniform. Mm. What's it do for you? It excites me. It's like a Superman uniform. A Superman uniform, huh? Yes. You say adrenaline rush? Yeah. Why is that? Well, you know you're gonna play for a crowd that's gonna go crazy for you. It's gonna love it. Throw their babies out to you. Throw their babies out, man. <laughs> I don't know, it just gives you a great feeling. Pride. You what goes through your well actually what goes through your mind just before y'all get out on the field here? Well, knowing that people look up to you and what you do, um, that you're not only performing for yourself, but everybody's looking for you guys there. They love you. Knowing that you have to do good for everybody. Your band, your school. It's a great feeling. What's it like getting dressed like this? What's this make you feel like? It makes you feel as a unit with the rest of the people, you know. We're all the same, so we can all do, we can all what goes, your, what goes through your mind just before you get out there? Hopefully I play a good show, so I will mess up and that's about it. What, what a trip over Number 129, I think. 129. Wow, what's the problem here? <laughs> Was he strangling you or something? <laughs> no, I'm not. I have to do. I'm just that We don't like sashes. Do what? <laughs> we don't like these things. <laughs> Why don't you like them? They're hard to put on. I told you. By the senior year, I'll figure this out. Where are you going to take my button? <laughs> What's this you're doing? I'm putting your gauntlets on. Man! Oh, that was pretty cool. Are we remustering? Yeah. Where's the What's it like getting ready to go, huh? Well, it's a lot better. We do a lot better performances in the uniforms. It kind of makes you feel more like part of these bands. Real little family. This band, talk about it. What's it feel like to know you're one of the best bands around? I mean, this is huge. Well, it's, it's, a, real, it's a real great feeling being up in the stands, especially during the retreat. During, um, after Bands of America, it was just... There's nothing like it. It's, it's unique. Hard to describe, especially when you come over here as a sophomore and you have 140 instant friends that will just do anything for you. It, it's great. It's, it's a wonderful feeling. Can you yourself? No. How's it feel, man? It's, uh, how's it feel? Well, see those? Uh huh. They poke. Do what? They poke. Do they? Yeah. So it's not too comfortable, huh? Oh, yeah, it's comfortable. It seems like performances are always a lot better when we're wearing them. It's just kind of the whole idea behind it. Gotta look perfect out there, right? Yes, you do. Yeah. What's it like uh, if you prepare? Tell us about it. Sometimes it gets a little hectic. You get kind of nervous and you worry about getting things done, you worry about getting things finished, but it's exciting. Kind of get your adrenaline pumping a little bit. How about yourself? Tell us, I know the theme of the show, World War II. It's got to be an honor to wear this uniform. Talk about that. Yes, it is. Um, we go in competitions. It's very eye-catching, but it's also debatable because sometimes our uniforms aren't right or if it's not exactly perfect, we get nailed for it. So it's nerve-wracking. We like it, though. How's that feel? Tell us about it. It's a little tight, but it's going to stay on. How about being in this band and, and using these uniforms to put on the show? What is that like? I think it brings on a lot of tradition for future bands. When they put on this uniform, they can say that, hey, you know, that last band, they did. Heroes lost and fallen in that uniform, where they can say, you know, 
I remember when we got the uniforms. I think it gives the band a lot of tradition. Gentlemen, start your engines, huh? Yeah. The roar of the Green Berets High School Band is just about to begin as they make their way to yet another Kelly, performance. Can you have Larry bring the bass drum over here? I want to be careful because that parking brake is still broke. the bass drum over here. Can't forget anything, huh? Can't forget anything, huh? No. Before a performance, you just want to think about everything that you need to do, and you want to get your focus, so your intent on your performance, and that's what I think about right before I go on the field. I guess I try to think about my show and try to do the best I can do. better with the uniforms. How's that feel, man, carrying that thing, huh? Heavy. Heavy, huh? Let's see you lift it. It's about it. What makes it so tough? It's not tough at all. Really? You gotta be a man. Let's see it, man. Let's see it one time. Go ahead, one time. Show us how you do it. Nothing to it, huh? Nope. What's it like just before you get out here and perform? You're so excited about how you're going to relay the show to the people in the stands and how they're going to react to what we're doing out here and what we're trying to emphasize. And it's just a, it's a great feeling. We just want a good sound and we have to work for it. And we tune up and we listen to each other. Great sound, isn't it? Yes. Got you yet? Yeah. Talk about that sound. Talk about it. Start Spangled Banner to the new ending. Talk about it. I don't know, it's like, it sounds good when everyone's in tune and you can hear all the parts, all the instruments differently. And it helps, you know, everything, your music and everything really well. Tell us about that emotion you're feeling just minutes before you take the field. Well, it's uh, overwhelming. It's just really, like, you wait and you have to get there and do it. Incredible feeling once you get ready to do it, huh? Yes.
We got you yet? Tell us about uh, what you all are doing here. Right here we're breathing. Um, they're breathing exercises to improve our uh, our uh, playing abilities. It makes our, our sound a lot better. How's it feel? Um, makes it, feel it makes you better. it makes you feel it makes you dizzy when you breathe really hard. Okay. Yep. Tell us about that. What, what's that make you feel like? Uh, it, it kind of uh, gets your lungs going a little bit better so that uh, it helps just people clear with, with your breath support and stuff so when you're playing you can play louder and more in tune and better and it kind of makes you really dizzy. <laughs> Blow me out of here. Blow me away. Blow me away. <laughs> Blow me away. Blow me away. There it is. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Can you breathe, man? No, I got a head rush. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Whoa, man. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> How does it feel, man? Oh, it feels great. It's, it's grand. <laughs> You know, it feels good. It's an experience. Is it? Something yeah. can't be missed. Let's see it again, man. Right in the camera. Right in the camera. Right in the face. <laughs> Back massaging 101. Here we go. How's that feel? Good. How is he? Pretty good massager? I'm excellent, aren't I, honey? Yep, yep, yep. Pretty good massager, huh? How's that feel? Good. How's it feel? I'm touching my hair. How you like it? Lovely. Ow! Ow! What's that do there? Okay. What does this do here? It massage your head. It loosens you up. What? It loosens you up. For in a very intense performance. You feel good? How is it? Very good. Good. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Feels better? How is it? <laughs> How is it? This is great! Great? Great! What's it mean for you to be in this band? Well, a lot. You know, the pride, the spirit, it's just wonderful. What's this show mean to you? Talk about it. Um, it's a, it's a tribute to the World War II heroes. Don't play any different than you would at a at a, at a performance. Okay, everybody to the ready. Come on, drum majors. What are you trying to get across to him, man? Um, to achieve balance, proper intonation. Just try to achieve a real nice sound, not to overplay and basically not to play ugly. So that's what we're trying to achieve here. What's that sound mean to you when you can hear it? Incredible, huh? It, it just has so much clarity to it. When it has the clarity to it, it just all the things work, and it just it, it's just a really dynamic sound to listen to.
always when I was in junior high, everybody was always like these fans, so it was really exciting to actually get up here finally, and it's really neat and exciting. What goes through your mind on the field? <laughs> hmm? What goes through your mind out on the field? Um, it's really intense, and I'm thinking about crowd response a lot, and just everything we go through in practice. So what goes through your mind after you're on the field? After I'm on the field? While you're on the field? Oh, um, just to do your best and try your hardest to um, have a good performance. How, uh, is, are you nervous out there at all, ever? Um, not really, because people are always cheering for you, and you just have to try to do your best, and it's, you don't really have time to be nervous. It's pretty exciting because of the people you get to meet, and just the friends that you make. You're really close, you're like a family, and I, I wouldn't give it up for the world. It really means a lot to me. You look forward to it when you're sitting here. Everybody was as like, excited to be here. What this show mean to you, the uh, World War II? Look right over here, don't look at the camera. Uh, um, it means everything about like all the war veterans and die for us in World War II. You've got to bring out some emotion, huh? Yeah. Talk about it. Um, well, the emotion part, it really expressed how they were when they did uh, World War II. What exactly does it mean to you to be in this band? Um, probably having people know that you're going to do the best that you can do and that you're really good and you're going to do something that really pleases them. How about the uh, the band? What makes this band so good? Probably the people, because like at a competition I went to, I had people come up and say, "Are you from the East Band? We're here to see you," and they really it me it means a lot to them what we do. We just do our show for the people. <laughs> Wonderful. I think it's really great that um, I'm allowed to be in this band and, um, you know, it's, it's, I feel really special that um, I was allowed to be in this band and I, I know there's a lot of people who like to be in it and weren't allowed to do it, so I feel really special that I'm allowed to do it. First, tell us about uh, what it's like out on the field performing the World War II theme. Oh, it, I think it's exciting. I love performing and I love the show and I think the people like it too. How about, uh, what's it mean to you to perform the show? To perform the show, I mean, I guess it just... Oh, oh gravy. <laughs> it just, it helps get the point across to what people really felt in World War II. I mean, so people understand what it was like to really be there. How about yourself? I guess American, uh, it just makes you proud to be an American. Talk about it. <laughs> well, it just, it helps like the veterans out in the audience to make it, when they see that we're performing what they went through, it's really emotional for them. It's great. I mean, you can never leave it. It's awesome. It's your family, your friends. Mm -hmm. How about yourself? Greenbury East High School, what's the name? Mm -hmm. I'm proud to be from Greenbury East High School. I'm proud to be a Spartan and it just gives me a great feeling. What goes through your mind when you're performing out on the field? Pardon? When you're performing on the field, what goes through your mind? I hope I make it to the next set without falling down. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'll tell you, right at the end, as you see the flag going up, that's what's awesome about it. So yeah, I got through it, and it was nice, it was loud, everything worked itself out. That's what it's about. When you step off that field or onto the field, you know that you have to have the pride. And that's what the East Bay is about, pride. How about yourself? Tell us about it. I think it's exciting. It's a lot of fun. I like the friendship and the family. And yourself, tell us about it. How um, are you going to remember it? Oh, gosh. Just all the friends you made when you were in band and stuff. An experience of being in, it, being in all these competitions and stuff. What are the competitions like? Scary, <laughs> <All right. laughs> but they're real exciting. You meet a lot of people. What's it like when people label you one of the best bands, high school bands on the East Coast? What's that like? It's great. Yeah. <laughs> you like you like the recognition and just it's nice to know that people know that you're there and that you know what you're doing and so do they. How about yourself? How are you going to remember bands? Scoot up, just scoot back, just look right over here. How are you going to remember bands someday? Um, I'll probably remember it by all the people commenting on all the performances that we've ever did and how good they were and how they touched those people. That's that's the main part is how they touched the people, the, the performances, just how they went deep into their heart. Nice job. 
How about yourself? How are you going to remember band? Write that down in your hand. Uh, I'm going to remember by all of the hard work and performances that we do. And it, it keep in our head about, about the music and the parents cheering and everything. It just, it just keep in your head. Nice job. This is your life, isn't it? Talk about it. Band? I mean, it really is when you think about it. I guess, since we have to practice every day, she's about. What's it like to be in the big parades and so forth? I think it's fun because everybody's like cheering for you and stuff as you go by. What's it mean to be in the Green Bar East High School Band? It's a lot of pressure to be like the best. Everybody's gunning for you. <laughs> Isn't that right? I guess. <laughs> Great feeling to be in the band, huh? Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> what would you like to say to the rest of the band? I like it. I don't. <laughs> oh, you're not shy, are you? <laughs> Anything else you want to say? Not really. Good job. <laughs> We're a big family, you know, we're the ones we spend the entire week together, the entire weekend, we're always together, we never leave each other's sides, it's kind of that sense of unity and friendship. And How about the theme, what's that mean to you? The Lonely Beach theme, it's our, it's our you know, salute and dedication to veterans and how much we appreciate them and how much we admire them for what they did for our country. One, two, one, two, ready, move. I've made a lot of friends and it's been a lot of responsibility, but it's been worth it, definitely. What's it like to know you touch people's lives in this performance? Um, well, it feels good. When we went to Morgantown, it was just, I had no idea the adrenaline and pumping and you're really excited. Hey, Chris. Well, it gives you a rush, I think. Um, I, I, you're all excited and you're all tense, but, um, you know your show, the show has a purpose and and you want to present it the best you can. It's real emotional. I mean people come up to you all the time and say thank you for doing the show. Um, we had fathers, grandfathers, or actually veterans have come up to us and said they've really felt emotional about it and they really enjoyed it. It's fun. What do you think of the Green Bar East Band? They're good. Awesome, huh? Let's see you say they're awesome. They're awesome. How about you? What's this show mean to you? It's a privilege. They're awesome. They're incredible. They're incredible. They're the best band on the East Coast. They're the best band on the East Coast. And the best band in West Virginia. And the best band in West Virginia. You may have to put words in some people's mouths, but the bottom line is it's all true. When you see the Greenbrier East Marching Band perform, it'll knock you out.
It was really a fulfilling experience. I, I've learned a lot and made a lot of friends. It just, it just means a lot. It's really gives you a lot of pride. Tell us about what it means to you to, to present this show and touch people's hearts like myself. It means a lot because it's a really good tribute to all the veterans of World War II and you know, they just, it, people when they see this, it really, it really does touch their heart. What's it mean to be in this band and how are you going to remember it? It's going to be something we'll always remember. You meet a lot of people, it's a real family unity and it's a real great thing. I think it means, it means a lot. It means family and it means friends. And it, it, it's something, it's something to be proud of, very proud of. All the hard work pays off now. It, it pays off, but when we come together, it's not the awards, but when we come together and do a great show and can feel good about it ourselves, then that, that's where it pays off. Well, the band gives you a sense of pride. Um, all of us work together like a family. And it really gives you a sense of accomplishment when all of us work together and achieve something. Whether we win or not, if we do a good performance and touch people, then we feel really good about ourselves. And what makes you all so special? I think it's because we're uh, so much of a family and we're all close together. And it just brings us all together and it shows in our performance. How are you going to remember band someday, do you think? Probably it's the best time in my life. I enjoy just being with my friends and spending time with them. Um, I almost played volleyball, but now I'm in band and I like it much better. It's just you're with more of your friends. How proud are you to wear this uniform? Very proud. Um, we're known all over the state as one of the best bands, and um, I just feel special to be in it. Uh, it means a lot. There's a lot of pride, a lot of respect. Uh, there's a lot of tradition in this band. It's just fun to carry it on. How about yourself? How are you going to remember the band? Uh, all the great times and fun we had and the trips and performances and the respect we get from other bands and people. What are those long trips like when you play in the big, big championships? Uh, really ner nervous, uh, a lot intense, and so, but it's fun and once you start, the adrenaline goes and it just won't stop. And it's, you're nervous at the beginning but then about the end of the show you want to do about three moves. How about the stadium? A lot of memories, huh? Uh-huh. Talk about it. Uh, it's just great coming here with all these people screaming and yelling for you. And it's, it's kind of different here because everybody supports you, unlike other football stadiums where they don't really care about the band and just the football team. But everybody loves you here and it's just a lot of fun. To find the Green Braves band, I mean, you all just flat don't ever give up. Talk about that. Um, I think a lot of that comes from Mr. Brian himself. He, he pushes us pretty hard, but it, it's all worth it. How are you going to remember band? Um, probably the, the friendship that you build in the band. Most, uh, most all your friends uh, here at school come, come from band. Like you come to school the first day and you have a lot of friends just because of band and band camp. Great feeling on the field, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I like to see the crowd and hear the crowd yell for us. Every, I mean, it's like everywhere we go, everyone they know us or you know, and when we get a standing ovation, it feels really good. Out here with the, the best band in the state, the best drum line in the world. It's okay. Great feeling to be a part of this band, huh? Yeah. How much are you going to miss it when the season ends? Oh, a lot. 
you know, all your friends, the whole band. No, you know. they're not going to watch it. <laughs> During the summer, it's your, it's your whole life. The theme of the show, incredible. Talk about it. Oh, uh, well, it's a really great feeling because you get the adrenaline going when you think of all the people in the stands that had, like, people in the wars and everything, and it just gets their adrenaline pumping, too. What do you think of, about this band? And always wanting to get better. Talk about that. Um, we just want to do our best, and we can only do our best if we get better each time. How about the theme? What's that make you feel like when you're out performing this theme of the show? Um, it makes me feel like I need to put on a good show for everybody, for all the veterans that were in the war and stuff. Proud, huh? Mm -hmm. I like the meaning of this show because I had a couple uncles that was in the war. It really touches your heart, doesn't it? Yes, it does. You're always going to remember, Van, I'm sure. Oh, definitely. Why do you do this? I mean, people are going to ask that question years from now. Why did you be a part of a band? <laughs> Just to get the family feel and to feel as though that I'm accomplishing something in my life rather than just going to high school. What did it teach you about life? Learn made me feel that, that I can manage my time around all the practices and everything and still get the grades that I need. Nice. The theme, World War II, had to be incredible, huh? Talk about it. It's, it means a lot to a lot of people. My dad's a veteran from the war, from one of the wars from Vietnam. My grandfather's from World War II. Touched their heart, huh? What's that like? I guess when you go out on the field, you almost dedicate the show to those kind of people. Yeah. And it takes a lot of hard work and dedication, but we have a lot of fun times, too. Why is Greenberg East the best band in the state of West Virginia? We just saw it. We can actually do what they tell us to. Great feeling, isn't it, to hear the, the crowd and the sound that comes out of those instruments? Yeah, it really is. What's it mean to you, this show, World War II show? Oh, a couple of my kinfolk are in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, fought in World War II, so it really means a lot to me. How much are you going to miss it when the season ends? Um, probably a lot. Why is that? Um, it's, it's like you're around your friends all the time and you do all this fun stuff and go on places and do all this stuff. What's, what's it like, those national competitions? They're stressful. Really? Yeah. It <laughs> takes a lot of time and concentration. Tell us about what it means to you to be in this band. I can sum it up in three words. Friendship, dedication, and memories. Can I hear you sing that song you all sing? What song? Da, 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 da. What is that song you all sing when you're coming on off the field? Help me out. Huh? I don't know it yet. Oh, you don't know it? What's that like when you all, when you all uh, hear that song, when you all walk in and you start singing that stuff? Well, it keeps you going there. It keeps you in time and everything. And start makes you start to focus. How about it? What's it like when you all hear those, you, you all can hear yourself sing those songs? Um, it's great. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> because, um, I don't, you feel a lot of pride and when everybody's yelling and stuff. <laughs> they love you, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's the crowd do? What's they the scream! Let's hear it. It's a lot of hard work, but it's fun, and it, all the work pays off. Yeah. How does it? Because when you go out to a competition, then you you like win, and everyone's cheering for you, and it all pays off. So, what are the competitions like? Uh, they're more fun than the practice. Why is that? Because you perform in front of the crowd, and you win. You listen to the crowd go nuts, huh? Yeah. I think I'm going to remember it as being a very good experience because we're one of the best bands in the state and it's been a really good opportunity and I'm very proud to be a part of Green Race Marching Band.
World War II theme. What's that like to know that you really touch all those people's lives? Uh, I don't know. It's, it gives you a warm feeling inside to show that you perform, touches many people, makes them, I mean, it brings back a memory from their past. Uh, tell us what's the thrill you get out of being in this band. Um, just knowing that we're the, almost the best in our country. And it's a good feeling because you have a group of friends that you'll never forget. And it's like when you come into this band, you make a lot of friends instantly. And when you come into this band, you perform and everything, and it's great. Well, since you know you're um, giving a dedication to people who have really lost their lives and stuff, it sends like emotion through your body, and um, you just want to perform and, you know, give the best tribute to you can to them. What's marching band like? Oh, it's just a lot of fun and the friendship and the pride and spirit and it's just so much fun and all the hard work does pay off. <laughs> Tell us about the, um, uh, the band. What's so special about this band? The friends you make, you always have them. You know, the friends you make forever. Um, it's kind of motivating and you think about all the people that's lost their lives and you feel for them and their families. It's really fun. What does it mean to be in this band? Well, it means a great deal of love and the experience of a family which you'll make friends forever and you'll be backed up by all your friends, they'll be around you forever, you'll never forget them. It's an experience of a lifetime. It's a great experience. Um, it's a lot of fun, it takes a lot of hard work and dedication, but it's great. I think it's really great to, you know, all the people that have died in war and uh, heroes lost and fallen, you know, and I think when you get out there on the field you just want to give them the best tribute you can, you know. What does that mean to you, the fight song? Um, I think it just motivates the band and gets everyone really excited to see the football team win and it motivates everybody. How about yourself, the fight song? Um, it just gets everyone motivated and um, it puts like pride. <laughs> It's really fun. It's, you feel real special to be in an organization like this, like the band. You have a lot of fun. It's a lot of hard work, but but it's, it pays off. Nice job. How about all the trophies you've won? What does that mean, all those trophies that sit in the band room? Well, it really it's, it's great to win trophies, but we're really not out there to win the trophies. We're out there to, to do the show the best we can for our World War II veterans. Tell us about it, the, uh, the show. What's it like when it all comes together? Uh, well, it's just... Hard to say, we put a lot of determination and dedication into it all. And when it comes together, it just makes you feel so good. Sends chills up your spine? Yeah, certainly. It's fun. Do you ever get emotional? Talk about that. Um, I try to. <laughs> you try to. You try to make it look really emotional to everybody out there because you just you want them to see how great it is and just a tribute to everybody. It's really hard for us to understand the emotion because we were not there at that time, but we try to um, put out the emotion the best we can so we can touch somebody up in the stands that's been there. What exactly does it mean to you to be in this band? Yes, I guess the feeling that of like a togetherness that you get whenever you whenever you're, after you've done all the work after you like place in a competition how about the competitions nationally what are those like uh they're fun they, you know you get to get out there and show a, a whole lot of people the show and you, know, you go in there and see all those people it's like wow you know great feeling isn't it huh? yeah, the big parades and everything yeah it's it's fun. It's cool. <laughs> Being in the flag section is really great. I mean, we're the visual part of the band, and I think we make up a lot of the show, you know, um, visually, and it gives people more of an overview of what the show's like. Yeah. How about marching band? What's it mean to you? Um, it means a whole lot. It it's just so great to be in, and it especially this show. It's about it's it's a tribute to the soldiers, so it just means a lot to me. Heart <laughs> Smooth.
Uh, it's probably the most fun I've ever had, the trips and just being with everyone, the bus rides home. And even though we sleep on gym floors, it's probably the funnest part of the, the trips because everyone's together. So it's really enjoyable. Nice. Um, just everyone has to lift each other up, you know, keep everyone motivated. Everyone's just a great big family. They're all really happy. It's a lot of fun. Um, it gives us a, me a lot of pride to know that, you know, I do this and plus to do the uh, Heroes Lost and Fallen show. It's a tribute to the veterans, you know, and I know how good that probably makes them feel when we go out into the field. We just want to do our best and, you know, give them something that honors them. You know, know that you're doing something for someone when you go out and perform like that. It means a lot because you're doing it for the people who died in the war and it gives you a lot of pride if you go out there and do the show your best and it makes you feel like you did it for them. Well, we practice a lot and that makes us really good, but I think what makes us the best is that we're a really strong group of people and we get along well with each other and these are the best friends you'll ever have in your life. Okay, this band's so good, I think, because um, all the practice and dedication and hard work we put into it, but most of all, it's the family relationship that this band has to offer. Everyone's willing to help every, everyone else, lift each other up during the hard times and we can get through this show and show the vet veterans what we want to portray all the, all the emotional effect. What makes this band so good? I think all the hard work we put into it, um, the pride and the friendships you make over the summer. And what makes you all so good? Well, we practice really hard, and we've been practicing since July, so. I mean, we work really hard, and the friends that we make help keep us together, so I think it's just togetherness and working hard. In band, you make a lot of friends, and not only like in the band, but it's a lot of times the staff you make friends with, and you know them just like they were still in high school. And I think a lot of people think that the band, that all we care about is winning, but I know that probably, no. I don't think I speak for myself, but I think that for most people in the band, it means a lot more to us to have a whole audience up on their feet and in tears than all the trophies Definitely. in the world would ever mean. And so I think the wind beneath your wings just shows that we're really strong for people, and even though there may be times when we're in hardships or something, we're still always, we always strong. come we're out always strong in the end. to let me shine, that's your way, you always walk a step behind, so I was the one with all the Nothing without you 